To make round stars, you must roll them. And you can either roll them out of raw composition, if you learn how to do that, or you can roll them on cores, which is probably the easiest way to start. So I start the machine, and the cores are jumping around in there. Then I got a little composition. This is Winokur's number 39 glitter. And I start putting it in there. And when I've got a little bit in there, I'm going to speed the process up. One unexpected benefit of this machine is that it has made mixing compositions very easy and a very painless process. Now this is in a way annoying. I purposely built a scum so I could show you how I could get rid of the scum. It's already cleaned itself off. When the machine arrived, the first night, I just simply went outside and my first batch came out. They weren't perfectly uniform. The only problem was that the uniformity was less than this. I, didn't, I hadn't learned how and where to put it. But they were all round stars. The bowl was in good shape. It went very quick. There was really very little learning curve.